Welcome back. Let's play some 10 minute games here on Shogi Wars. How about that? Against the king on the first rank, the rook on the second rank. It feels like that's something our community should learn over time, if not already. That if you're trying to checkmate, uh, don't always check the king. Good luck. But sometimes try to anticipate what the opponent's doing. Um, so, yeah, it helps to be one step ahead of the crowd. Okay. Uh, apparently this is what we're doing now. That's kind of cool. Um, so... Yeah, oh hi there had recommended um, this kind of approach, and it looks kind of fun, so should we try it? That I don't need to push this edge pawn, I just put the silver here? Or is this a bit speculative? I don't know about this. Um, the rook moving to this file looks... I mean, this is an interesting castle. I almost kind of wish I left the previous proverb on um, the screen here, where it was all about um, uh, keep the king and the rook separate, move them to opposite squares, which is kind of the opposite of what's happened here. Um, I suspect that transport would be more than a bit critical of my opponent's play here. Um, so I'm offering up my center pawn because I believe in my attack. Maybe that's a crazy strategy. Okay. That looks even nuttier, however. Um, have I missed something? I'm in check. Okay. What is this? What is my opponent trying to do? I mean, I should have been asking this the whole time and not just right now, but... Um, I didn't believe in any of this, and I'm still struggling to believe it. So... Yeah. I don't know what to make of any of this. Um, I could take this, then they... They can't even take my silver. They could fork me here. Um, so, I defend. Have I missed something? I don't think I've missed anything critical here. So the bishop cannot... Okay. I mean, that's an idea. Yeah, that's a cool idea. I don't know if that works, but it looks pretty cool. Um, hmm. Knight takes, bishop takes, silver takes, rook takes, promotes. I've won a piece, but I've not won the war. But it's, I mean, that's fine. Well, no, I've won an exchange this way, which is not as good as winning a piece. I could also no, no, back no. off my rook, or move it up here. Um, hmm. Bishop 
There's multiple ways to play this. I think I should just take that, however. It's not as if my knight's going to do anything better than taking that, so I'll just take it. Um... And then do I want the horse? Because that's another upgrade. I think I want that. So there's some risk in giving the opponent two pieces to attack me with. However, um, I mean, my material situation is pretty nice here. If, okay. Now they have three pieces in hand to attack me with. So I need to be careful. But I think I have things under control. I'm also threatening Rook Drop and myself starting some kind of an attack, but uh, probably they'll drop a silver and my Rook's trapped. So we don't do that. But I could bring out the Bishop, or I could drop another Bishop. Um, they're probably looking at the Rook Drop here, threatening the Silver Drop. Yeah. Makes sense. So I'll just play this in defense of my position. And they will get another dragon, and that's fine. So I've got two silvers and a bishop. My opponent has a dragon. I've come out okay. Um, it is spooky. Go <laughs> Hoon. Okay, I cover five five and this square. They might drop some they might drop a knight now that I see that, but I could pin the knight. Yeah, they this burns a tempo. It's a reasonable way to burn it though. Well, I mean Actually, there's... no, okay. Yeah, that does make sense. I don't have a way to easily exploit that. So we'll just drop where the opponent wants to drop. And they'll take my pawn, and I'll take their lance, and we'll call it a day. Um... Interesting. I think this is fine. I'm not fully sure. If I retreat, they've got all kinds of peace drops that are super spooky. But I think I'm fine here. Silver takes silver drop, and pawn drop is messy. Um, yeah, this is this looks reasonable to me. And if they retreat, uh, we continue evicting this damn dragon. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, I'm in time pressure, aren't I? Just a touch. Interesting. Obviously, they're targeting this fork if I were to take the pawn. But this isn't checkers, and I don't have to take your pieces. Okay, they have two silvers. I miscounted. Um... I'll target this next to the king. Okay. That's fine. I mean, I could retreat here, right? Hmm, what to do? I can continue defending. And now I'm threatening the lance drop on the center file. I guess they're going to take this anyway. But no, I've got this defended. I don't want to drop my lance, because that breaks my defense. Mm -hmm. Two minutes. Hmm. Hopefully this isn't terrible. Hmm, what a mess.
1分うん。time pressure makes fools of us all. Yeah, I'm losing this against、um, quite the incredible effort. There's nothing I can do to resist this. Oh, I should have moved my bishop. Yeah, I'm screwed. Um. I could have hung up the towel from the o p e n honestly. Oh, well, that's no good. Thanks for the game. Well played. Yeah. One down, two to go. Good luck. I'm reminded a bit of episode one.、Um, of the rather famous、uh, franchise. And the plot emphasized or discussed、um, use of a particular artifact. And then there was discussion among characters of well, what if we fail to get the artifact? And then the next discussion point was well, that'd be extremely bad, so we just have to succeed. I'm like, thanks for covering the plot point there, but um, um, it seemed a bit、um, forced. It was odd for movie dialogue. Among other oddities in that franchise, but you know. Oh, hey, look. I'm improvising now. I just gave up this pawn. I don't know that it matters. Like, this seems such an obvious target here. And if the opponent tries to do anything, just chase it. Um, okay.
actually going to wimp out and retreat here. And I don't know what my castle's... Is this going to be right hand king or something now? What am I doing? I don't know. Um, Alright, so... Okay... We are finding a unique strategy. There we go. Unique strategy located. Um, interesting. My opponent has not applied any pressure here, so I should just, like, tuck the king over. There, this is safe, right? Do I get an opening named after me if I win this? Asking for a friend. Um... The notion of if I win this seems a bit nebulous, because I'm... There's no way that I'm winning this. Well, okay, I say that. And then this happens. Um, and if I just taken the bishop... Well, I guess I could have pinned the rook or dragon. I would have done just fine. But this seems even better. I don't know why. This was so tempting. Um, I mean, if I don't, they're just going to push through. Still, why am I in any hurry here? Oh my god. Am I considering that? Um, interesting. All right, I see a tactic. <laughs> We're going to try this. Don't try this at home. Um, mm-hmm. Don't try this at home. Nanafun. All right, I got a rook. Let's try to be happy with that. Um, I just trapped my rook. I'm smart. Um. Okay. Against a king on the first rank, the rook on the second rank. Checks out. Um, not sure I have an idea, though. <laughs> an idea would be valued here. Uh, I have to defend, or I'm just screwed. So, well, even so, I'm probably dead. Even if I try to defend this, they have this drop. I have to run, they have another drop. I'm, yeah. This is not good. Um, they probably should have dropped the other piece. So, I need to come up with a good move here. I need to come up with a really good move here to try to justify my nonsense. Um, I don't think there is one.
I've got Night Drop, Gold Moves. Hmm. I mean, I'm not going to get any better than this, so let's just do it. Okay. Uh, we'll see the knockout blow soon enough. That is a fork. Um, hmm. I have to block this check. Because otherwise they can keep dropping pieces. Okay. So, Go do I just defend this square somehow, or do I have an attack? I don't know. I think it might depend on their response here. Um, I'm still not sure if I have an attack. I probably have mate in one somehow. I just don't see it. Like, silver drop, bishop takes. Um, but silver drop here, silver takes. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not sure what to do. Oh, if they check, I just drop something to block the check. Duh. Alright. If I push this pawn... I'm probably dead. If I don't push it, they still have night drop and all these other checks, so I'm still dead. So I have to take this? Okay. But then they still have night drop. Gold drop, silver drop, whatever. Um, yeah, finding... Oh, wait, I can take this, actually. This is crazy. Knight drop, king over. They keep dropping stuff, my king walks up here. This is perfectly safe. Nothing could go wrong. <laughs> um, yeah. Alright. Okay, they've got a rook. And they've vacated squares for other pieces to be dropped. Oh, night drop? Yeah, night drop mates. I missed that. Well, this looked cool. Uh, there should be a badge for putting your king in the middle of the board. You'd probably lose most games where you do it, but, um, you know, it's still... Yeah, there we go. Thanks for the game. Dang. Oops. So the question comes, should I keep playing this opening that I don't understand? Um, good luck. And that presumes that I understand other openings, doesn't it? Maybe. Um, okay, let's play a different opening. Mm -hmm. Okay, fine, we'll play this. I'm not claiming I know it, but, um... These are moves. This is a shogi board. Playing one strategy all the time might be overrated. Although there are many data points in favor of playing something that you know. Um... Hey, I could take this. What could go wrong? Everything. Um, 
So I think this is fine. So this is the fortress shape, I guess. Um Yeah, we got the duck. All right. All right. So, uh it's all uphill from here, right? Um mm. Yeah, I don't know how to play the duck. Um I'm not playing it right. We'll push this edge, because I'm just supremely at a loss here. Um, okay, what? I know I don't know how to play the duck, but still... Um, that doesn't do anything. This is... okay, I mean, that's reasonable-ish. Uh, I guess we'll tuck the rook back, because, again, I don't know what's going on. Oh. Oops. Okay. I live barely. Um, because I'm seeing the threat one move ahead of time, but... Um, yeah, if they'd play this in a different move order, I'd be not sitting so pretty here. Oh, that's interesting. I didn't even notice this. Nanafun. Okay, that's the king's pawn. Um, I'm just making a mental note here. Hmm, I don't like this. I don't like what I'm seeing that's going to happen next here. They push this, and it's not easy for me to deal with. Um, so I'm going to try to break this attack before it hits too hard.
curious. What does this achieve? Like, yeah, they can drop the pawn back here. Um, but they've arrested their own attack with this pawn. Mm hmm. I could run. I should run. We're running. Gofun. Okay, they dodged my bishop. That's just somewhat clever. Um. What the hell? I got a free pawn. Um, maybe that was a mouse slip or something? I don't know. Is my strategy in these games just to wait for a mouse slip and then take advantage of it? Or do I have some broader strategy. Um, okay, that is somewhat menacing, so I do need to capture this. Oh no, they're going to get my lance. Whatever will I do? <laughs> I guess, um, oh no, my lance for Shogi is what Chess has for oh no, my rook. It's the same uh, concept. All right. They checked me again, I'm just going to block, I guess, with the pawn or a knight or something. The knight block is interesting. The opponent wants to drop here or use the square in some meaningful way. They might just want to trap my silver, but um, there are tactics everywhere here. In a position that could have been one-sided... Uh, it looks like there's a, a struggle afoot. Plus, I'm threatening to push this and then drop another pawn. Well, that invites the knight in and I die. I don't want to do that. But someday I might, but probably not. <sighs> okay, that's legal. It's actually not terrible. Wait, what's the next move? Where is this going? Okay. Oh, damn it. I walked into a fork. I wasn't using my rook anyway, but... Um, yeah, I could have dodged this fork. But I didn't. 
So now the opponent has a rook. And I have a strong pro rook bias. Um Mm-hmm. It'd be nice to evict this. Sampun. I thought I had a combination here. I no longer think I have a combination here. Uh, well, this could be interesting. If the rook takes bishop drop and then bishop takes here. Oh, poo. Alright, uh, that is forking at least two pieces, but... Wait, do I... Uh, I do want to resign. There's no question about that, but... Um, it's fine if I don't. Yeah, alright, thanks. Yeah, thanks for the game. All right, so today we got to play openings that I have not normally played. And yeah, results came that should have been expected, but somehow weren't. Um, so instead of being on the verge of ranking up, uh, we're halfway down again. But um, yeah, it's going to be a journey. We'll get there eventually. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.